Yeah. Me? See, I got I got custody of my daughter. I've been raising my daughter for 10 years by myself. I'm done with the situation now because the cops is involved. As soon as police involved, what? it's over. But all my, why you won't, my, why you won't my, try to get custody? As soon as police is called, because I don't do the system. I don't do the system. I don't fuck with the system. She called the police, put me in the system. So here the thing is, I'm completely done with it all. The truth about the matter is, I'm done. That's what I'm going to say. I'm done trying. I'm done. I'm going to let it come to me. I'm done trying. I ain't. So, you put me in the system. How, how old she? Huh? How old she is? Who? How old she is? Who that is? Your daughter. She two now. How old your daughter? She two. Two? Mm -hmm. Man, you better go get your kid, man. No. I got my daughter when she was three. No, I ain't. I'm not, I'm not, no, I ain't fucking with the system, bro. See, the thing is, like, I grew up in prison. Yeah. I grew up in jail. I grew up in foster homes, foster care, and in jail. So, I'm anti-system. You know what I'm saying? So, you got I to break that generation purse, man. No, I ain't, I'm not fucking with these people. I'm not, I'm not going to ask another man, can I have my daughter? You don't understand, like, I'm a man. I feel like I'm a man just like anybody else. So, the man that runs this world... I got to ask him for permission because she's within his domain. I got to ask him permission to see my daughter and to work out my issues with a woman that I made a baby with. Yes. You see what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, yes. I feel like I'm a man. And since I can't be a man and be able to handle my own business, because the man that runs this system ain't nobody he has to go to to ask about his children. I shouldn't have to go to nobody to ask. You know what I'm saying? Hey, can I see my daughter? For what? That's mine. You feel what I'm saying? So she ran to another man, a man, a man that she's supposedly supposed to be against. She ran to the system, right? And she asking this man to protect her from me. Huh? You understand? That's how I'm looking at this. What type of, what type she, she of asking shit the that white is? Man, she asking the white man, hey, can you protect me? From him, so she on their team. You understand? She 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 on white supremacy team. She called white supremacy and say, "Hey, can you protect me from him?" See, if she did that, you already in the system. You should try to go for custody. No, absolutely not. I ref I'm gonna tell you again. You I refuse to ask a white man, <laughs> "Can I have my daughter?" And him give me permission. See the way you and him. Him to even give me permission to have my what's mine. But for see, you know ask, about the crazy. For me to even ask for permission is to humiliate me. I refuse. I'll make another baby. <clears throat> Before I do that, I'll make 30 more babies. You crazy? You got to be out there. I, I understand you where you're coming from. I'm about to I, beg I, this I white man to see my daughter who mine. Fuck no. I'm going to get me a lawyer. And I'm gonna get a. I'm gonna get a restraining order on her, cause she's stalking me. My lawyer. I'm gonna ask my lawyer for a restraining order from that girl, cause she's stalking me. And I'm done with it. And that's it. And I ain't even gonna do that, cause I don't need nobody to protect me. I don't need no white man to protect me. I'm not even gonna do that. I could have did that, but really, I'm too much of a man to ask for protection from them niggas. Fuck them niggas. I protect myself. Fuck that. But I, if I want to be dirty and play like that, I could. I could say, protect me from this bitch who keeps stalking me. I go on Bigo. She was on Instagram. Fine. I moved to Bigo. She get on Bigo. I go to Puerto Rico. I'm out here minding my business, doing my thing, everybody. And all of a sudden, I get videos of my daughter laying on a fucking mattress in a crack house. What you think I was supposed to do? That right, that they alone. They they're showing, you a, video, they're they're showing you a video of me coming to check up on my daughter as a man. I'm concerned about my daughter. And if that's if something wrong with that, so be it. I, I take the punishment for that. But I was I'm a, any man in his right mind would have did the same thing. It's not a crack house, but it looked like one. It looked like a crack house. It looked like a crack house. It looked like a crack. You seen the video, stains all on the wall, old stuff. You understand? I don't care where I go. I stay, I make sure I stay in something clean and luxury. You crazy? You you in Florida? No, I'm in I'm in Puerto Rico. Oh, you live in Puerto Rico? 
Yeah. Damn. But shit. I, I just want to see see what's going on. I be trolling these Beagle streets. Have you though, seen your daughter? If somebody show you video of your daughter on a mattress, and she said, and they tell you the Elvin ain't here, and you see your daughter sitting on a dirty mattress with another child, and you know where your daughter's at, what you about to do? What would you do? That'd be the last day. Hey, that'd be the last day she'd be in that house. What would you do? Tell me in the chat. What would you do? As a man, all the men in the chat, what would you do? My daughter be going with me the same day. <laughs> would you have been at that house and if the, if the blinds was right there, would you have cracked the window to see if your daughter was okay, to ask some people to let you see your daughter, to make sure she was okay? I rest my case, your honor. I rest my case. So when you see that video, like, know, know what the content is when you see that video of me looking in the house, making sure I'm asking them to let me see my daughter. And all them three big ass men in that house could have came out like men. It's just me. Damn, how, how many men it's in three there? Big ass niggas in there, man. She, she, it's three big ass niggas in there, man. They could have came out. They wait for police to come out for them to feel safe enough to come out and talk trash to me, man. <laughs> as soon as they Damn. see me, they ran in the house. I said, "Look at these big ass niggas running in the house from me." They I get my boy because I'm just coming to that. see if my daughter okay. Because listen, I'm a father, bro, and I ain't I ain't with the social media when it comes to this shit, bro. If you show me my daughter on a dirty mattress and I know where she at, I'm coming for. What can you talking about, bro? And I got every right to do that, nigga. I ain't know she was. Dirty. I'm a fool. I'm a full-time father every day, all day. I ain't on play that shit. About my kids. Daughter. I almost caught a case about my daughter. That's why yeah. she in my custody now. Yeah, I don't play when it comes to my baby. With my children, I don't play. I'm coming running. I'm, I'm a super dad. I come running. I don't play with my kids, bro. Any, all my baby mamas can tell you. This is why I ain't got no problem with none of other my baby mama but her. Because other, my, my other baby mama, I can call them right now. We talk. They know I'm a super dad, dead ass. That mean, when I say I'm a super dad, I mean I'm always there for my kids no matter what. Now, they, they mother don't agree with me. They want to be in the system. They want to be in that system. So as soon as you call a system, I ain't got nothing to do with it. The child ain't even mine no more. If the child was mine, I'd be able to go get her. Biologically, she's mine. Legally, she belongs to the state. And it's just, it's just like that. <laughs> you feel me? Like, it ain't mine because it was mine. I'd be able to go get it. Without asking permission from another man. Can I get my daughter? Excuse me, sir. Can I see my daughter? Can I get visitations, please, with my daughter? Picture that with a Kodak, nigga. I'm a grown-ass man. The fuck is you talking about? I'm not about to ask no man. Hey, Can I see my daughter? That's it. You got to be that's out so crazy. Of my mind. I ain't there you go. Yeah, that's all. I wish a nigga would try me. Mm-hmm. Put that all in there, yeah. You feel me? So... As much as I love my daughter, I ain't, I'm not going against what, what I stand on. You feel me? And my daughter going to have to understand that one day. Your dad did not want to be a part of the system. You feel me? I'm in this world. I'm not of it. You you going to have to explain that to her when she get older. Yeah, she going to understand because I'm going to tell her when she find me, you know, inshallah. So for right now, I'm just going to make more children. But That's mom, it. The the mama fucked up for having to ride them strange men, though. She just met these people. She don't even know these people from a hole in the wall, and then they live in a hole in the wall. They live in a hole in the wall. She don't know these people from a hole in the wall, and they live in a hole in the wall. Tell them to do a video of the house. Tell them to show you a video of that house mm -hmm. and the situation that my daughter is in. And tell me. She lived right across from the project here in Puerto Rico, which is hella dangerous. Cause it's all it, she live out here with these people don't even fucking play around. She live out, she live right across the street from the projects, bro. You think I wasn't gonna come That's for my great. daughter, man? You think I wasn't gonna come for my daughter, man? Let her say whatever she it, 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 it see it, real. If you don't do nothing about it, you 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 fail. 
Well, I failed. But if you do do something and get your daughter, I failed. You'll be blessed. No, I failed. I failed. I'll be but damn. if you if you I'm go if you, you go get them, I'm gonna tell you again, sir. Sir, I'm gonna tell you again. I, Fuck the system. I understand bro. where you're coming from. And I'm just gonna tell you like that. Fuck the system. I'm not about to ask no man. I just told you how I feel about it. I'm not about to ask no man for no permission. I, I, for my, I heard you. It's enough that she jammed me up in the court date in the system that I'm in now. I do not fuck with them people. I do not fuck with these people. I do not fuck with these people, bro. Period. And I guess I failed in your eyes. Because in my eyes, I'm not a failure. Fuck, fuck. I, I made my daughter in Mexico. Fuck is you talking about? That's how much I... My daughter was made in Mexico. That's how much I don't like... I don't fuck with these people, bro. My daughter was made in Mexico. Conceived and believed. Mexico. Mexico. I'm a field nigga. Damn. I'm not a house nigga, so it's a different. You might not understand that, bro. I fail, and your I eyes, are hey. in my eyes, I will succeed. I will rise. The black man is God. I keep telling y'all that. I'm from the bush. Hey, I'm from the bush. I know about all that. No, I'm not about to beg no man for rights over my daughter. Can you please let me see my daughter? I'm a man. What I look like going to another man? That's this is what this is exactly what you asking me to do. You asking me. You ain't got to say please. No, 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 no. That's what you're doing. You're getting permission to have rights. Rights. So what do you have to do with my business as, a, as the government? Right? As an external party to what's going on here, what is it your business about what I'm doing with me and my lady and my child? It ain't none of your business. But she put them in our business. Because she put them in our business, now they're going to make it their business. And it's them versus me at all times. Or oh, I know I got to be, because I'm a man and that's a man. And anybody working for the system is working for the man. You're not understanding this is an invisible man. It's one man that run everything. The straw man. <laughs> the straw man. <laughs> yeah. they, don't, they don't get it. They don't get it. <laughs> you know who the straw man is? You heard of that before? The straw man? The straw man. Yeah, that's the straw man. Yeah, the straw man is what they told you you was. It ain't who you are. See this loose hair? <laughs> the neck is loose hair to my shit. It's gonna make skin off. Then cut this. Snip it. Damn. The black. Yeah, that shit crazy though, yeah, man. Sure. She need to fix it, right? Help her fix it. Come on. Okay. Fix it, cause she he's struggling. She about to get fired. No, she, it looks good. You sure? Yeah, it looks really good. Okay, she won't get fired. She won't get fired. Oh, he's he's not gonna get fired. Effort, you about to get fired. Yeah, you're gonna get fired. I'm gonna send you back to the village. Hey, what? Hey, what is called when you when your dreads like that right there? It's called. Uh, these called wick lock. Wicks, yeah, wicks. They wick locks. My old, my old lady dreads down past her ass. She, that's sexy to me. Yeah, they, they, they long. She been growing them for ten years. I snip the ends. Snip the ends. Is the ends you know, straight? These parts up? No, just like. Yeah, anything that's sticking out, just snip it. Make sure, like around here, just snip the, snip the end. Make sure it's nice and smooth. But yeah, I'm, I'm gonna let you carry on with your show, man. Hey, man, I appreciate you. Keep if you tune in, man, you'll find out a lot if you want to know. It's too old. So I be, I be tuning in, story, man. I I know I be tuning in here now. <laughs> Fuck with me. All right. Yep. Baba G. What's up, beloved? You're so talented. 
But to be honest, but. if you are a real G, then how come everybody that you are over has to have your mind and not their own mind? Because I'm a man and this is my world. You feel what I'm saying? This is my government. Just like, just like the government wants you to put your kids in school to learn their education. You know, you could ask the government the same thing. Like, why do I have to educate my kids to your education? You know what I'm saying? Because you live in their world. And that's their world. They made that world. They want they, your children belong to them. And so all of y'all have to have be educated. And if you don't educate the kids, you'll go to jail and they'll take the kids from you. You see how that works? I you know, feel I'm you. Saying? I feel you for sure. Yeah, but so if I'm a man, I want to create my own world. I do me. This is my world. They agreed to it. They wanted it. They They chose that. You feel me? They can you exist with mind. other gods? Do I have? But can with you other exist gods? with other gods? You said what? Can you exist with other gods? Can I do. You, or I you cannot have to be the only not god in the world. God. I, I cannot exist with other gods without because uh, there's other people on this planet. We coexist. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm here, you here. Other there's other men that's here. There's other men doing their thing here. Every man is doing his thing in his own world. So I am existing. I ain't bothering nobody. I ain't, I'm not disrespecting nobody. I'm in my world. I'm out of my business. I'm doing me. I ain't hurting nobody. You feel what I'm saying? And, um, you know, maybe I hurt people's feelings. No, I ain't going to say none of that. Well, I'm just saying. I maybe ain't going to put that on you. Yeah, no. Because like you said, everybody them. knows. Everyone I might hurt somebody's feelings, but I ain't hurt nobody. Well, make sure these joints is right. Okay, so I've heard a really good quote that, like, leaders are always learning. And evolving, but I it seems like you say you don't need to learn, you know everything. How can you really be a king if you aren't learning anymore? Who said they learn who said they know everything? You have. No. You don't need to watch anything, you don't need to read anything, you don't need to research anything. No, I, all I'm saying is I that, mean, come on. No, 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 no. I never said that. So you misquoting me. Um what I said is that no one can teach you how to be you. Only you know how to be you. And when you tap into yourself, then you are who you are. And what you know is what you know because it's who you are. That's what I'm saying. I know what I know. That's all I'm saying. I'm learning every day from everybody else. I, can, I can't know everything because I'm only a piece of everything. A piece of everything? Yeah, you you another version of me. You a parallel version of me. Like me and you, we the same thing and different perspectives of that thing. So we are the same thing. Okay. You, well, I can't know who what you, you know, all that you know. All I know is what I know. I was my purpose is to know who I am and be me to the full pack okay. capacity. Who do you look up to? Who do you look up to? I don't. I, I don't. I look up to to me. I look up to me. There's no one that you look up to. No. Hmm. No. I think you should really think about that. What about evolving into? I'm gonna be honest with you, man. Only thing I look up to is the black woman. The black woman is sexy as hell to me. Um, she's the she's she's pure power to me. To be real with you, I worship the black woman. And her, and like, well, okay, when I, yeah. When I say that, I'm saying that to you. Like, that's the only thing that inspires me is the woman, black woman, and. Helping other people, help other black men understand their purpose and understand the knowledge. But the black woman is the most powerful thing on this planet. I collect black women. I love them. I want as many women around me. They inspire me. They, they, black woman is the reason that my life is good. Without a woman, I'll be the saddest man in this world. I wouldn't want to live without a woman. I want to die. So I have to say I look up to a woman. When I say that, I look up to the essence of what a woman is, period. You know what I'm well, so I just, you know I just what? want when the best it? woman on the planet. I want to let me tell you something. Without money, what make a man powerful? His mind, right? I would no. say his mind. Come Without on. Without money, what make a man powerful? God. Think about this. This is a good question. Without money, what make a man powerful? Oh my gosh, but Baba G, you know that white supremacy has left so many of our black men out of the economic, out of the economy, and I'm gonna just ask you the last question. And just because they don't last have money, question. they're still men. Beloved, 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 you're not listening. I ask you a question. Without money, 
If they were to abolish money right now, what would make a man powerful? I got to go with his mind. I'm sorry. It's his of mind. Of course his mind would be a part of his power, but what would what would be the validation of his mind? What would what, oh, man. what would make that man powerful? What without money his what mind, Baba powerful? G. How many women his can mind? Have? No, you're not listening. His mind, of course, but what his mind can do would make him powerful. What's the most powerful thing he can do without money? Woman. <laughs> woman. Without no money, without nothing. How many women can you have? How many women can you attract? That's it. That's the bare minimum of all power. Women are the power. That's it. Period. Uh, Let's get straight to the point. Straight to the point. Without no money, if we took all the money off the planet, how many, you know what would be powerful? The man with the most woman. Because he can make the biggest family. And he can Bobby get the G, most reason. If you lose everything he, tomorrow. He can get the most reason. If, you, if I lost you everything, as long as I got worthy? all these women with me, as long as I got all these women with me, I'm the most powerful man on the planet. Your validation is on the outside, man. Come on. Your validation the is, outside on, is the on the outside. The outside is the inside. Somebody said resources. That's a fact. The woman going to be the greatest resource you could ever have in your life. A woman is the greatest resource you could ever have in your life. Period. Well, can't you get a woman without resources? I think you have before. No, no, no. What are you talking about? What are you, what are you talking about? As far as, res as far as money and women being what makes a man a man? What about the men that don't have either? That doesn't mean they're not real men. And I what never you said there was a real man. Today? I never said that. I never said there was a real man. I'm saying what's gonna make you the most powerful is how many women you got. Period. And the quality of the woman and what their abilities are. Period. As a fact, I'm telling you, as a as an educated man that has figured out this whole thing, there's nothing more powerful than a woman. That's it. That's it. Well, I think of everything is being done for that woman. Period. You feel what I'm saying? I don't know if y'all understand that, but niggas do niggas do everything they do for women, bro. Women are the key to all of this, bro. The key. That's it. When you got a woman to do what you, if you can control a woman, you can control the world, bitch. You can control a woman, you can control the world. You gonna have money. Money gonna come to you because you got a woman, bro. Women attract everything. You need resources, everything, bro. I'm just being all the way real with you, bro. Eat, look at the strip club. What is the oldest profession in human history? Prostitution. Don't worry. I'll wait. Y'all not getting it. You don't get it. You don't get it. You don't get it. Before there was anything, before there was farming, before there was resources, anything, there was a man and his woman. <laughs> okay? And then, and then, if the more women you have, the more bigger your legacy can be, your family can be. And the more bigger your family can be, shit, you can start your own nation because of your motherfucking woman. You can't even build nothing without a woman, dog. That's the only thing that inspires me. I got to tell you, bro. All I need is my woman. That's it. The woman around me, I love them. I love the way they look. I love the way they smell. I love the way they titties jiggle. Woman, nigga. Woman. That's all I need. What's up, Nisha? Some niggas, they think, oh, if I get the drugs, then I can make the money. Then I can get the woman. Either way, it's for a woman. Everything for a woman. <laughs> What's up, Nisha? You just gonna breathe? Nisha, you live, Nisha. Nisha, you live, baby. Baby, you on live. Nisha. Madre. You on the live, Nisha. Oh. <laughs> you don't even know she on live. I just... Hey, Mama G. Yo, what's up, Kiliana? Next thing I love the grill. 
He love it. Yeah, he looks it. real good. I just wanted to say you're right, though. Prostitution is the oldest profession, and men, they do do stuff for women, like, you know, and the women, they do stuff for men. The way you dress, everything is for a woman. And the more women you can get, right. the more babies you can have, the more bigger you can have an influence over other human beings. Before there was anything, there was just, there was me, this other man. That man got one wife. I got five wives. Whose family in 20 years is going to be more powerful, his or mine? Mine. Because I got more people. I have more influence. So it's like, if we start everything from the very beginning, the, the woman is the power, period. It's the power that we use ourselves through. The man is the power, but he uses his power through the woman. You ain't got no power if you ain't got that power to go through no woman. That woman got the, the power. Got The power that a man has, he has all the power, but he needs the woman for it to go through. Right. That's, it's the same thing with making a baby. You feel me? Bye bye Z. I want to know if you, you can't could, make 20 um, kids with one woman. You can make 20 kids with one woman. You still going to need to make them people with my people. Because the, the children that you have, if they mate with each other, they're going to kill each other. They're going to, this going to die. I'm telling you that if a man got, if we started from, if we started from complete nothing, right? Complete right. nothing. If I had complete nothing and I have 10 wives and one man, I could populate the earth. But if we had, we had one woman, one man, it, it would be almost damn near impossible to populate the earth with one woman and one man. Right, because they won't reproduce and make no more people. The, yeah, I get it, Kendra. You feel me? So the power is in a woman, bro. The, the, the man holds the power. <clears throat> but the, but he ain't nothing without a woman. <laughs> you heard you heard with Jane. It's a man's world. But it I see nothing, passion. But there would be nothing without a woman or a girl. And the, and I just told you. I'm telling you the real shit. Yeah, you be speaking fake, Baba G. They just don't hear you. Peace. He said, "Who do I look up to? Who do I look? Who do I look up to?" And the only thing I could ever think of. That I look up like, and I and I feel like when I look at it, I'm inspired. Is a woman. That's it. That's the only thing I right. could tell you that I could look up and say, "Damn, that and my family, and my children, and my brothers, and my and, and, and my warriors, and my family, they inspire me. My family, I look up to them. What I'm I look up to it." I get up and I'm inspired when I look at these women walking around naked around me. All this ass and beautiful titties around me. Ain't nothing like a woman. Nothing. Get to the point, man. Get to the motherfucking point. Okay? Woman, nigga. That's fake. <laughs> you feel me? So, even if, you gay, even if you gay, you love a woman. Gay right. people love you. Gay people love. Yeah, love Where's Dr. Bishop? Dr. Bishop? Yeah, I love him. Dr. Bishop chilling, man. We really appreciate him. Yeah, I fuck with Dr. Bishop. He cool hip over. Yeah, Dr. Bishop, he he be he cool. No cap. Dr. Bishop. Well, peace, Baba. My dude. All right, baby. Be good, beautiful. Love you, too.